Hey everyone, did you know that Earth has another moon? Yep, you heard that right. While most of us are familiar with our big old moon, there's actually another celestial body that's been hanging around Earth for quite some time. It's called 3753 Kruthni. Now don't worry if you've never heard of it, it's not exactly a typical moon. Kruthni is what scientists call a quasi-satellite. This means it's not directly orbiting Earth like our regular moon, but it has an orbit that resonates with Earth's own orbit around the Sun. To put it simply, it shares a similar path with Earth. So, how does it work? Imagine Earth and Kruthni dancing around the Sun in a complex pattern. Kruthni follows a horseshoe-shaped orbit relative to Earth. Over the course of 770 years, Kruthni comes closer to Earth, drifts away and then gets close again. It's like a cosmic game of tag, but on a much grander scale. But why isn't it our official second moon? Well, because it's not gravitationally bound to Earth in the same way our moon is. It's more like a cosmic companion, keeping us company as it goes around the sun. Interestingly, Kruthni isn't the only quasi-satellite out there. Scientists have discovered several of these celestial bodies that share similar orbits with Earth but Kruthni remains the most famous and well-studied among them. You might be wondering, can we see Kruthni from Earth? Uh, unfortunately, it's too small and too far away to be visible with the naked eye. But with a decent telescope and the right conditions, you might just catch a glimpse of this fascinating little rock. Uh, so there you have it. <laughs> Earth doesn't just have one moon, it has a whole dance troupe of celestial companions. The universe is full of surprises, and sometimes those surprises are right in our own cosmic backyard. If you enjoyed this mind-blowing fact, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you've got any questions or topics you'd like me to cover, drop them in the comments below. And until next time, keep looking up and stay curious. <laughs> Thanks for watching. But wait, there's more. Did you know that Kruthni's orbit is not the only interesting thing about it? Its orbit is actually quite eccentric, meaning it has a more elongated path compared to Earth's nearly circular orbit. This eccentricity causes Kruthni to sometimes come relatively close to Earth and at other times it drifts far away into space. This unique orbit is what makes Kruthni such a fascinating object of study for astronomers. They are constantly monitoring its path to understand more about the dynamics of our solar system. And who knows, maybe one day we'll discover even more quasi-satellites or other celestial companions that share our journey around the Sun. The universe is vast and full of mysteries, and each discovery brings us one step closer to understanding our place in it. So, keep your eyes on the skies and your mind open to the wonders of the cosmos. Thanks again for watching, and until next time, stay curious and keep exploring. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with fellow space enthusiasts. See you in the next video. Bye for now.